All right, guys. Hey, so I'm back. Um, again, this is a project to remove a lot of chrome from my 2016 Fat Bob. The next things on the list that I wanted to remove are the chrome jiffy stand and the chrome cover here. Uh, I like the fact that it said 103 on it, so I got myself the denim black. 103 over there and I got a black jiffy stand off of the 2016 get out of the shadow here off a 2016 Dyna S model uh, they come off uh, I think it was a lowrider had an all-black kickstand or jiffy stand so again trying to remove a lot of the chrome so uh, I ran into an issue though because if you look underneath the bike, I don't know if the lighting's gonna work, but my jack is like right up against the jiffy stand and I can't move it because the the oil pan for the Dyna is on the other side and right in between the two jack stands. So I can't really get myself any more room to work on that jiffy stand over there. Uh, so I'm gonna probably have to go to a friend's house who uh, has a motorcycle shop and and uh, have him use his jack or, or perhaps even a, a, a bike lift so that we can get this uh, get this uh, jiffy stand replaced with the black model. So work in progress, but I will do the, uh, the cover today and uh, show you how it looks. All right, back back in a minute. All right, guys, back. So this is what the bike looks like now with the black 103 clutch cover on. Very easy install. Here's the original. I think it looks a lot better with the uh, the black. That is the stock clutch cover from the Lowrider, I want to say. I think it belongs on the Fat Bob, especially in this color. Uh, denim black. Anyway, uh, the kick, uh, the jiffy stand, I'm still going to have uh, someone else help me with this. Because like I said, this jack um, just won't, won't let me work in that area very easily. Uh, so I'm going to have to take it to somebody else to help me with that. Uh, we'll let you know as soon as that's done. Alright guys, that's it for now. Thanks for watching. Bye.